reason they build these, their nests out of rocks is to lift the egg and the chick out of um, the muck that's around, particularly after snow begins to melt. They do collect rocks and you know make sure their mate is uh, you know, well taken care of before they go off to see the, the feed. And so that's how these how they maintain their nest is you know, these bouts of collecting rocks. And so that's one of the signs of them going off. Like there's this one penguin right here that's gathering a lot of rocks and bringing them to its nest where its mate is standing and probably that penguin is going to be leaving pretty soon. I can tell because its mate is very clean and it is very dirty. It was a nest that somebody went to see and as soon as he, he left, everybody else is coming and getting his rocks. So that's why you need to have a pair of penguins and if you want to have a good rock pile, because one penguin has to always be there to defend the pile. Otherwise, this is what happens. Um, everybody comes and raids all the rocks. So pretty, in another hour, there won't be any rocks left in that scoop. The penguins are spaced their nests like this in order to prevent skewers from walking between and stealing eggs or chicks. So usually, like you notice that there's the penguins on nests aren't very rarely do they face one another. They're always turned somewhat away from one another because facing another penguin is sort of an aggressive thing to do. So these penguins are they're amongst the most expressive of all birds. They they can sleek their feathers and look really innocent or when they're aroused and angry, their crest comes up. And that's all, those are all signals to one another of you know, what they're thinking about.